Hey folks, I'm Mike. Do you hate ads? I hate ads. You know what I like? Patreon.com slash Inkdependence. It keeps this blog ad free. Hello and welcome to Inkdependence.com. Today we're taking a look at this box of stuff. I actually don't know what's in here. This is... Uh, this is a box of stuff that Audrey ordered from Goldspot. Uh, her birthday was recently, and they uh, sent her an email and said, Hey, if you order stuff, you can get a free jotter. I'm uh, employing the gentle box opener here. Uh, and so she said, Well, I'm going to order some stuff then. And uh, I don't know what she ordered. How do I get into this darn box? Here we go. I opened the wrong thing. And so uh, she said, Hey, I've got a package coming today. You should do an unboxing. So she wouldn't tell me what was in it. And, uh, so I don't know, so we'll just see what's in here. Eh, open. There we go. All right. All right, all right. So, uh, there's a bunch of stuff in here. Look at all the things. So many things. All right. Uh, so, first off, I think this is actually the jotter. Let me move the box over here. Uh, I think this is her jotter that she picked out. And, uh, oh, that's nice. It's a little, uh, little bronze guy. A little bronze, uh, metal-bodied jotter. These are great little pens. I have a blue plastic one. Actually, I have, <laughs> I have a few. Uh, this is the one I've had for years. This is her new little, or I guess it's copper. Anyway, copper. Uh, but otherwise, pretty much the same thing. Just hers is a little nicer than mine. Uh, and then I have this one also, which is the XL. Uh, so there's these. There's the XL next to the, next to the regular. It is, uh... Is a good bit bigger all the way around. All right, cool. Well, a little copper jotter. Nice. Nice, nice. Let me put this back in the boxes. Get in the. There we go. Get in the. Come on. You can. All right. So, a jotter. That's fun. Chelsea Orange is actually the name of that jotter. Chelsea Orange. Turn on the light a little bit, a little hot. All right. Uh, what else? We got some more stuff in here. Here we have a uh, Lamy Safari. Interesting. In rose. Oh, she got one of the new pastel ones, huh? Well, look at there. This is the new Lamy Safari in rose. Uh, they've just come out with uh, a few of these pastel guys. And uh, this is the rose one. It's a very nice color, sort of a pale pink. Looks good. She got a fine nib on there, no surprise. Has an ink cartridge in there. There you go. A little spacer guy. I'll leave that in there for her. Yeah, all right, that's fun. I mean, I am team all-star always, but uh, nonetheless, that's a pretty one. All right, so, uh, what else do we have here? We have uh, something in a little envelope here. She might have gotten converters for these things. Yeah, yeah, all right. So there's a converter. Uh, pretty typical Lamy converter. <laughs> Stuck to the tape. There we go. Gotta have a converter. Uh, here's another thing. Probably another converter, I guess. Ugh, missed the tape on them. There we go. Uh, yep, another Lamy converter. So we probably got another Lamy in our future here. Uh, and here we have, we have a, a bookmark. Cool, with the SD on it. A little Henry David Thoreau. That's uh, the order form here. Oh, Powder Rose is what they call that. All right. Ah, this is a this is a tiny little guy. I guess this is a Moon Man, maybe. Yeah, Moon Man Wan Kai Mini Dream Swirl Resin Fountain Pen Fine Point. All right, this is sixteen bucks for this guy. That is that is very small. I have here. We have some uh, little black cartridges. Say ink. <laughs> cool, I guess. Have an eyedropper for eyedroppering the pen. I guess that's a nice inclusion. This is a teeny tiny little pen. Look at this thing. Look at that. It doesn't even... Man, I don't know if I could even use that. I couldn't use that very much at all. 
without screwing the back on. Screw the back on, it's okay. This step here is still massive. All right, well, there's the, uh, the Wen Kai Moon Man. It's kind of cute. Probably look better with a little bit of ink back here. Probably take some, uh, take some silicone grease. Cat's chewing on a box. Yeah, maybe it won't need silicone grease, actually. Oh, it's got a little... It's actually got a, uh, an O-ring here at the end. So, probably don't need silicone grease since it has an O-ring. Uh, so, there we go. All right. Cool. Clearly meant to be eyedropper, and they give you an eyedropper with it. There we go. All right. What else do we have in here? Some paper. And a Kaveco of some kind. Probably a Kaveco Sport. Doesn't actually say anywhere on here what it is. Man, I'm glad I don't have to pull this uh, merch, because, man, it's really annoying when it doesn't say what it is on the outside of the box. I get that you want to, you know... <laughs> have only one kind of box, but oh, she went for the frosty blue one. Let's see, what is this called? Uh, yeah, blueberry frosted sport fountain pen, double broad, twenty-seven bucks for this little guy. There we go. So that's a lot of that's a lot of tipping right there. Let's see if I can get how close I can get. There we go. Oh, that tipping. That's a double broad Kaveco nib. Yeah. All right. Alrighty. Yeah, that's a cute little pen. I've only got one of these Kaveco Sports. I've got a, an old clear one that I've had for quite a long time. Uh, but this is actually pretty darn nice. Yeah, it's a nice looking pen. Feels nice in the hand. Uh, if they just make these a little bit longer so you could actually put a converter in them, that would be super. I don't know why she got two converters. She might have made a mistake there and gotten, gotten too many converters. <laughs> but there we go. All right. Well, cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right, well, there's a fun little unboxing there. It's nice when it's all surprises, because I didn't buy any of these things. Uh, so, Audrey did. It's not like nobody bought it, but Audrey did. So, uh, we've got a Kaveco Sport in Blueberry. We've got this little Wayne Kai uh, Moon Man Dream Swirl Mini. Uh, we've got a rose-colored uh, Safari, and we've got a bronze Jotter. Sorry, it's a... Uh, uh, Chelsea Orange Jotter. All right, so that's it. Uh, I have one thing that I actually got in the mail today, and that was this. Uh, this was sent out to me uh, by a viewer. It was a total surprise. So uh, thanks very much, Donald, for sending out this bottle of Groff von Faber-Castell Burned Orange. Uh, I found this in this was in my PO box. I wasn't even expecting anything, but. Um, I imagine Donald has actually said a few times, or somebody has, I, f I forget who now, uh, on the uh, the live show on uh, Friday afternoons, uh, that I need to try this ink out, and I haven't had a chance to, and I kept putting it off, and just kind of just didn't do it. And so he sent me this very nice note, and it's like, hey, it's a gift for you, please review it. So um, you'll be uh, almost certainly seeing a uh, burned orange. Oh, dang, look at that. A burned orange review here in the near future. I just got this today. So, all right. Thank you very much, uh, Donald, for sending this out. Uh, thanks to Audrey for letting me do an unboxing on her box of goodies, uh, including a birthday jotter. And uh, that's it. I'll see you later. Peace out. Thanks, Nose.